Where is Agent S? Agent S, get in here. Oh, sorry, sir. I'm coming right now. You're late to another briefing, Agent. Sorry, I was playing the new Nintendo Switch. You've been doing that for five days straight. Uh, but it's awesome, sir. I don't care. I'm not your authority. I'm not your authority. Our bosses are. And we have another case for the Midnight Who Files. Oh, we have a case? Yes. Really? We actually have a case? Yes, I know. We finally have one. We, we finally have. We finally have our very first cheap DVD they're finally giving us. Oh, excellent. Well, here at the Midnight Who Files, we must research the cheapest DVDs. Let's I don't know, I don't understand how I have a job anymore. What, you investigate DVDs? Yeah. But I find in bargain bins. Well, let's see what we get, shall we? Please be good, please be good, please be good, please be good. Please be good. Uh, Spider Man Mutant Agenda. Go research this. Go. You're the researcher. Go. On my way, sir. The agent's gone. We're able to do your research. Of course. Come in closer. Okay, so. Before we get into your research, let's take a look at this cover, shall we? What do we got here? Spider Man Mutant Agenda hmm. featuring bonus episodes from Iron, Iron Man, the animated series. It has 100 minutes of animated adventures. Uh, I see a problem, though. The Spider Man right there. Do you notice a problem, Agent? His web does not connect to anything. Mm hmm. He is literally swinging. <laughs> Using a yeah. piece, little tiny piece of web. Yes. But I also noticed something interesting up here. What? The uh, limited edition? Limited edition. Well, this must mean it's rare. I don't go let me, rare. Let me look. Let me look. Let me look how much they paid for this. Daily briefing. They paid one dollar for this. Perfect. That helps. Uh, let's see. Let's see how limited this is. This came out in the year two thousand and eight. Okay. Let's take a look at the disc. Okay, the disc looks official. Still the boat. They're really promoting that bonus Iron Man. Look at this. Iron yeah, Man. Yeah, but I don't know if the disc looks official. Because <laughs> if you look at it, it looks like just a sticker they shoved on here. <laughs> it doesn't even look like it was printed on the disc or anything. It literally looks like a sticker they slapped on the front of this thing. Uh, you notice that? Well, yeah. Uh, hmm. That's interesting. I've never seen that before on a disc. No. That. Distributed exclusively in Canada by Morningstar Entertainment. Yes, that I was actually going to get into that. Really? What do you got? So, this DVD was distributed by Morningstar Entertainment. And don't and the I researched though before we started this, the website when you left when okay. you left before we started with this I researched the website. It's a DIY website now. Well, yes, it do is. You any, do you know anything about that? Uh, not really. Apparently, I believe they folded. Mm, you think I, I'm, I'm pretty sure they folded. <laughs> Either that or it's this other morning star that I discovered that has no mention of this movie or any of the other movies. <laughs> um, yeah, this seems a very obscure title. I also did some research while you were away, and um, apparently this was a VHS transfer. Yes, it was. Wow. It's and, from the uh, 1970s. I researched this from the 1990s, Spider-Man, Joe. Oh, that's what I meant, 1990s. Well, yeah, we were just investigating a 1970s Doctor Who episode. That's it was 19, 1994, I believe. Yes. And Morningstar was actually a Canadian company. That's interesting. They were in Canada, and then they got the rights to do a... And then they moved to the U.S. Okay. And there they got a couple rights to do, to do some different shows hmm. in, the, in the late 2000s. Interesting. So this happened around 2008? Or thereabouts. Hmm. So in 2007... Um, the Morningstar moved here, and they brought two shows with them. They brought the Smurfs and the Magic Flute, and they also brought the Garbage Warrior, a documentary. And both of those were re-released hmm. in America, the Smurfs for the 50th anniversary, and the Garbage Warriors, just because it was a fairly popular documentary. Hmm. And so, this movie came a little bit later after that, and the reason that it is a limited edition is because... It's a Canada re-release of a VHS. Of a VHS. Uh, now we did. Um, we should watch this. Yes. Let's put it on. Okay. That was. Um. Interesting. That was. Interesting. Did you notice something? What? It seems to start off in the middle of a show. <laughs> yes, it does. Um, I heard though. 
is I'm wondering, yeah. I heard about the Spider-Man show, and they did a lot of crossovers and like two-part episodes. So maybe this was like a part three or something. It seemed like it was right in the middle of, um, Action. like right after he transformed. Yeah, or something's going on that we don't know about. So I'm not too sure if I like that. Yeah. Kind of cuts off, but... But our job is not to do a review. Nope. It's to, de it's to determine if we wasted money. And do we waste money, Watcher? I would have to say yes. You think we wasted money? It's kind of hard <laughs> to enjoy a show when you don't understand what's going on. Mm -hmm. We basically bought, or they, our superiors, yes. bought a show from halfway through. Yeah. But they had no idea what was going to on. To me, it's still cool to have something Spider-Man from the 90s, though. Yes, I know. You're obsessed with Spider-Man, boss. I'm not your boss. Co-worker? Fine, co-worker. Our... I think that's another case done. Meh. Mm hmm? Yes. All we have to do, put it in the envelope. Let's send that off. <sighs> okay, we don't need to do that. You know our boss doesn't like when we fold things. <laughs> I'm being nice to him. You know Why? He, he hates us, remember? I know. But luckily, get... that's another case solved. Yes, the case of the... Mysterious Spider-Man DVD. The Mysterious Spider-Man DVD has been solved. It was a re-release of the show on a DVD format from a Canadian company. Not bad for a dollar, though. No. That's for sure. Still not worth a dollar, though. <laughs> what do you mean it's not worth a dollar? You get two bonus Iron Man adventures. Yeah, we should probably should have watched those. We didn't, though. But we don't have enough time. Well, this was Agent S. Agent E. And we shall see you for the next briefing, boss. Bye. Back to the switch.